Hey guys, and welcome to my uh, t tutorial on all the add-ons I use in Wildstar, specifically for medic healing. Um, the first add-on you're going to see here is going to be my Aura Mastery. My Aura Mastery allows me to track my individual skills um, or any type of event, really, um, to kind of gauge whether or not I have an ability ready, whether something proc, something like that. So as you can see, if I use many probes, many probes will stop flashing and it will add a timer to it, which will be my cooldown. Um, you can do a bunch of stuff with this. I have a separate tutorial on how to do things with uh, order of mastery that you can, that you'll see in the link below. Um, moving on, the second add-on that I like is the track master. Track master is this dotted line here. So I have it set up so it goes to my current target, so it draws a line to my target, no matter who my target. Um, the nice thing about that is if I'm healing and I don't know where some DPS is ran off to, all I have to do is click on them and it will immediately point me into the direction that they're at. So um, that's really, really helpful. Another thing it can do is if you add the Trackmaster Subdue add-on, is it will track your weapon when it drops. So when you get disarmed, your weapons on the ground, it'll immediately draw a line to your weapon. Um, the next add-on I use is BG Plates. So BG Plates is this, um, this little health bar up here that um, I have currently only on target or if I'm in combat. So I use this for basically everything. Um, I use it to see whether or not my group members have low shield or low health. Um, I like it a lot more than the health bars in Wildstar because A, they work and B, it distinguishes between the shield and the, uh, the health bar themselves, so, and it looks a lot cleaner. Another add-on that I use is going to be this Potato UI down here. Potato UI is basically um, a new UI for your frame plates, um, player plates and target plates and stuff like that. Um, the biggest thing I like to use this for is to be able to see cleanly what my health percent is at, my focus percent is at, um, and my shield percent is at, and my targets as well, and my target targets. And um, I like the giant cast bar it adds. So as you see down here, I move this, everything's movable within this. I just move the cast bar right below me, which is really nice. Um, another add on that I use is called Interrupter. So if I target myself real quick, and I start casting something, you'll see this additional bar pop up up here. Now it may just look like a cast bar, but what it is is it's a, it's basically whatever your target is, or you can set it to focus, that whatever your target is casting, it'll show it. So if you need to, um, like I usually will target um, like the shamans inside of a storm town, like when they cast a rejuvenate, I'll just target the the shaman and when they start to cast it I'll know and I can run over there and interrupt them real quick. So it's a nice little thing that tells you basically what your target is currently casting in a very big manner. So the other add-ons that I use is um, better combat text and better uh, chat text. They just simple as UI tweaks that make it in my opinion a little bit more easier to read. Stuff like that. Um, the other ones I use is the damage meter over here, which allows you to track um, the current fight, previous fights. Um, you can track a bunch of stuff within that. You can get all mob damage done and taken from either spells or units. You can do player damage done and taken, and some additional thing like effective healing, healing received, and player deaths, which in my opinion is pretty darn nice. So. The only other add-on that I really use that's important here um, is the threat meter I use so I can know um, specifically if a DPS is being stupid and getting too much threat on the target. That will just pop up and in during combat or unless you open it up like I just did. Another one I use is this, uh, the galaxy bags which is nice because as soon as you click on any vendor, it automatically sells any junk and it repairs for you. Um, you can also adjust the size of the icons. Um, you can decide whether or not they display elder gems, prestige, or non-crafting members there. Um, see, so you can 
your items for rogue and go way down. You can increase the size. So it's really a nice bag add-on that allows you full customizability rather than the one that comes with the game. Um, so I will go ahead and show you all the add-ons I have um, just so you know what the names are. These are all, you, you can get all of them through Curse. So I'll say some of them I didn't mention. Um, so mention or Mastery, Better Chat Live, Better Combat Decks. Yep, Galaxy Library. Um, I don't have it enabled right now, but it's basically a library of everything in the game. So it's be nice to know, like, you know, what an item would look like on you at level 50, stuff like that. Um, Galaxy Meter is the DPS meter. Grid is a healing add-on that I haven't really monkeyed with at all. I uh, haven't really need to use a healing add-on like that. Um, oh, another one I didn't mention I have enabled, I can't really show you right now. It's called Icon Loot. What it does is it shows up a... Um, maybe I can... Okay, so just like that. So you see on the right in the middle here and on the left side, it will tell you all the stuff that you picked up instead of just like, the, in my opinion, a really lame version of Wild Stars. And if you win a loot, it'll tell you right in the middle there. So, um, which is really nice. So, other than that, Interrupter, Junket. Um, I don't use Junket anymore because I now use the uh, uh, that bag add-on. Junket used to do the same thing. Uh, movable frames is not fully up to date right now, but what it allows you to do is it allows you to move pretty much anything in the game UI-wise. Um, I don't use Prox HUD, and I used to use Prox HUD before I used Aura Mastery. Space Stash is the uh, add-on for bags. Threat Meter, Track Master, and Track Master Subdue. So, um, there you guys have it. All the add-ons that I use, in my opinion, are irrespectable if your computer can run them right now in beta. Um, and runs fine, add these add-ons, and your quality of life will probably skyrocket. Thanks for watching.